Today I'm showing you how to diagnose this power jack WPW3520-80. Uh, complaint was power jack wasn't moving. They had power. It's contact to engage, but it won't go forward or backward. So let's take a look. Okay, first find out. Go ahead, engage it. Horn doesn't work, pump doesn't work, emergency doesn't work, nothing working. Let's open up. Take a look. Okay. So, using the meter to find out. So, right now, I'm going to check, make sure that all inline fuses are good. So, I'm going to switch this on to own. Right now, take the battery off. So, there's no power. So, it'd be safe work on this. So now what I'm looking for is this two fuses right here and the main fuses, okay? The main fuses is this looking thing right here. Okay, that's the main fuse. This is the, the secondary fuse and another secondary fuse. So I'm gonna use in my own meter. Check my meter to make sure they're good. Okay, it's beeping. So I'm gonna use this card from it. Okay, first one is beep, so it's good. Second one, uh oh, it's not beeping. Show and open, so which means it's that that fuse is open, so we have to double check on that. Now we we'll check the main fuse. Okay, main fuse. Oh. You see it? Ah, that's bad fuse as well. So, it's open. So, we got two. One is a main fuse, and then one is a small fuse. Everything in here, it looked nice and neat. The wires don't show anything burn, not yet. So, many things is cut right here. Could be this right here. You see this right there. So, that could be the problem is causing the main fuse to blow okay and then further down looking to here there's a switch there's a lip switch safety lip switch there is a contactor lip contactor so this is a bleeding solenoid this is horn look at that so poor wiring caused the secondary fuses to blow uh, all right let's go ahead and replace both of the fuses and i'm going to show you how i got both fuses here the small one this is the same one that i want to have 15 amp uh side glasses fuse this is uh this is the main fuse it's it show uh, 200 LKN 200 amp fuse so I'm going to change this out okay after install those two fuses we gotta check and make sure they're good before we start it out and first we have to find out why it's blowing the fuse so I will show you where, why, why it's blowing the fuses Let's the, the cable is wrapping here, and then we got a loose wires over here by the the positive signal on the horn. It touched them to the ground. It blown the fuses. Now let's go ahead and check, make sure they're good. There we go. It's 
beeping and then the one that we place one here all right and then also check this one just make sure okay everything else is looked done now we're gonna check on the startup in okay set the meter to volt make sure dc guys that's ac Okay, it's DC. <laughs> All right, we got positive battery and then negative battery. Okay, we got 24 volts, guys. So use the negative, leave it there. Use the positive to find out if your fuses are good so the first of one there you go there you have it 24 volt down here we got 24 volt fuses we got 24 volt now I move to the bottom one 24 volt next fuse 24 volt now the last one. Okay, this is called a live voltage test. So everything correct. Let's see what's going on. Happen. Okay. Alrighty. We have the handle. Voila. We have flipped off. We have flipped off. So check out my short horn. Right. That's this guy. Thanks for watching. Ciao.